Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to your channel. This is gonna be uh, one uncomfortable watch. If you don't like hearing uncomfortable stuff, please exit. Go watch something else. But uh, here I am. I'm gonna force myself to listen to this disgusting shit. So, uh, yeah, man, let's go ahead and do it. Like, if your ass <clears throat> shit comes out of there, it's your asshole. You know, I don't sometimes. See that. But, but, but it's reality. Like, you don't see I it, see. but that's just what it is. Like, this is purple, but you could be like, well, I see yellow, but like, it's really purple. You know what I'm saying? So, it is your asshole. So, does it hurt? It's like people can say what they want about my body parts but this is um, how you're i pretty. feel you're like you're very yeah pretty. and i have a pretty asshole yeah <laughs> yeah that's cool so just and guys want to fuck just... it yeah. i know but why am i doing this to myself right now and does it hurt yeah um you know yeah, it depends on like how do you get off i get off from being fucked but it hurts not necessarily are you you get turned on by a man wanting you is that what i get turn turned on, on yeah by a man that sees me as a woman and you're not a woman though you got a dick you're not a woman wants to explore Bro, just be gay just say you're gay and you like to cross dress and you like to put makeup on and shit like more in their life and i think that women like myself can provide that mm. like what like you could you could be both <laughs> we could just be an experience for a guy but also we want more than that more than just being an experience for them we're looking for somebody that's going to stand up for us but okay so we're so caught so up with why, these guys what made you want to be a girl it wasn't what made me want to be a girl i always had a feminine brain from as long as i can remember how the fuck would you know how Can I say something? Go ahead. I'll, I'm a female, right? So I said Absolutely. this to the last trans girl. People say that I'm masculine all the time. They call me masculine. But I don't feel like I have, and I and I do like, I feel like I'm dominant, but I don't want to be a man. We all exude different. I see yeah. it. That's yeah. the Brooklyn in you. I know But I think up. we're so yeah. used to that with being around so people from New like York. So do you feel like maybe you're, maybe you're just like a feminine man? Um, like, Absolutely not. Because. You know? That's exactly what you are. Feminine man. You you can tell he's getting offended right now. But you have a dick still. Yeah, I do. It's beautiful. Mm hmm Oh my god, this is the same guy that said he's not, he's straight. This guy claims to be straight. And he just said that this guy's dick looks beautiful. But he's straight. <clears throat> and I love that he loves you so much. That's like fucking awesome. I'll fucking He's, die on this shit. Straight up. I'll and I've never die. had somebody stand up for me so much. Your parents are um, probably so embarrassed of you. My father? Pff, boy, forget about he it. Disowned he disowned People come up to my yeah, father. Yeah, off People. the life. And As he should. As he should. Embarrassment to the family. Insurance. People, yeah, I'm off, I'm off the what life insurance. Hey, hey, I what don't even need that hundred. The life nah, sure, I don't even need that hundred fifty grand. You but can well, take well, me well, off. Yeah. I'm gonna what get that either way. What did he do to you that you're doing this to him? Uh, you're and you're and humiliating and, 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 a family. What, what, did, what did my father do to me? Real quick, we gotta get back to real something. We're gonna touch real stuff. Yeah. Why am I attracted to her? Because the way she takes care of her femininity, her feminine attributes, the way she takes care of them. I mean, this girl is always well put together for her. Man. This guy is looking for feminine characteristics. In a guy, and he claims that he's not gay, or claims to be straight, bro. Just, just be gay. Like, 
you don't have to like work around it. Just be gay. It's okay. Just be gay. Man, the house, cleaning, the food, taking care of her body. And not that clothes. a woman is supposed to do that. Correct. This is what she likes to do for me. And I don't expect and what it. I like to do. Regular women weren't doing that for you. Um, I, I mean, I had an ex-girlfriend I dated five and a half years, not to disrespect her. Um, you know, I, my drug addiction destroyed that relationship. Um, she did a lot for me. She tried her hardest. Um, I'm a tough cookie. She tried her hardest, but you know, she wasn't a guy. So, you know, I was, I wasn't into her. She was a guy. I'm a tough person You're a to lot. date. You're I'm a fucking I'm a fucking wild motherfucker. This shit, but you guys didn't want to. Well, do it was like it was cool with it. five years ago. Nobody even wanted to talk to women like us. But now, because we're in such a uh, a media light, you're not a woman. Stop saying that. Everybody wants to kind of be a part of that, <laughs> and including a lot of high up people. It's like who. I have a lot of people in my DMs. Name, name, me, name me some rappers. We, uh, I can't just, name just, rappers, but rapper they do have... Well, so how big of a rapper? I can't, I can't name anybody, Wait, but they big? do have their own shoe line. Uh, he just dropped an album about two months ago that was pretty big. Um, and then another rapper, well, he dropped a single two weeks ago that was pretty big. We can't really get into the names and yeah. specifics, but there's somebody that... But I've, I've also... But I've also... <laughs> been flown out by to certain by, places by, by NFL players. Really? Yeah. You know, people think it's a shock, but then, you know, a lot of guys are still so not you get socially. Flown out and then what happens? Fuck. I go there and we hang out. <laughs> like you're not scared? Obviously, it's a risk going, but... Once you know that everything's legit, I've had to sign NDAs. I've had to be completely frisked going into a place. And it's something that brings a lot of kind of confidence to somebody. Mm -hmm. It shows, wow, like he sees me as beautiful mm -hmm. too. And all these guys see somebody like me beautiful. But are I find you, myself beautiful like already. I've been used as a fetish, for sure. But that doesn't define me. You're a fetish for sick people. Nobody, nobody with, with, in their right mind will look at this and know it's a man and then says, yeah, I want that. People with mental illness think that. And I've sought out a lot of my own fetishes. I wouldn't know you're a man. I told you that. Right, I wouldn't, I w like because if sitting here and let's say exactly, talking, and a I lot of people not. want to talk about oh, like I would know, I would know sitting next to her. I, you can't tell. In person, I've talked to to regular women, and they don't know. I've worked at regular jobs before. Nah, nah, nah. You got a strong face. I can definitely tell. That that strong face is not fooling no one. Trust me. Here in Florida. Here in South Florida. When you were swinging? Yeah, when I was swinging with couples and the couples, like, yeah, we want to do this. I mean, you don't understand, majority of these situations, I wasn't a sober man. Mm -hmm. Right now, it's my sober face. I wasn't a sober person. Mm -hmm. So when you do... So he's blaming his, his gay acts on being under the influence. Yet now, he's not under the influence anymore. But yet, he's still going after those, those, those pleasures. So you're gay. Do drugs, what does that do? That opens your different passageways that you generally can't tap into. So what the fuck happened? I tried things that I can't tap into normally. Um, still to this day, I don't feel any regret. And I, I mean, I have stuff on my, only, I have stuff on my only fans with men. You, but th you think every man's been tried gay stuff? Well, no, but I think every man's... Thought about it? No, but I think a lot of guys have tried, you know, anal pleasure. Yeah. Get the fuck out of here with that. Please stop it. But they don't want to talk about it. I know a lot of men that get pegged by their wives, but they... And they're not straight. They're, they're, they're gay. They're DL. They claim straight, but then you're coming at my man yeah. when I don't even fuck him. Yeah, she don't so do that. what's that about? But he, he, you said you suck her dick. 
Absolutely. Get me out. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. He, you let's let's hear this again. I talk about it. I know a lot of men that get pegged by their wives, but they claim straight. But then you're coming at my man. Yeah. When I don't even fuck him. Yeah, she don't so that. what's that about? But he, he, you said you suck her dick. Absolutely. Get me out. Huh? God presented my lady with... That's, that's what she has to feel pleasure. We all want to feel pleasure and feel relief. And that's what God gave her to feel pleasure and relief. Best fucking belief. And I just kind of like being fucked, you know? Like she doesn't even exactly enjoy that. Yeah. That's something that, that's something that I like to do to show her that... You have a little bit of dominance on me. Because as a dominant man, sometimes it feels good to have her. I have a little bit of dominance on you. So, I'm going to suck you know what. Oh, man. Don't be like this guy. Don't ever be like this guy. Ever. Her be like, oh, this is what you're going to do, right? But if that's what she's presented to be pleasured and she needs to feel that, I'm going to do that because this is who I love. It doesn't matter who... My dad, my mom, my friends, whatever they mm -hmm. think, whoever finds out, I don't care, bro. I, I put this out here. I did. I put this out to the world. And nobody else this do is this. my man. I know everything about him. She knows She knows all the guys I've been with. I got guys in my OnlyFans. I've I, I been with black men, bro, on my OnlyFans. It's on there. That's how I make bread. What That's how I make a living. What do you do with them? What do you do with them? I've, I've let them fuck me. You've let This guy still thinks he's straight. He thinks he's straight. He literally just admitted to getting smashed on camera. And he lets people do it. And he comes out and says, I'm straight. Let them fuck you? Absolutely. <gasps> In my fucking heart, I still feel straight. You're not going to break my belief. You're not going to break what's in my heart. It's not my belief. So you this suck is what's dicks? in my heart. What's that? You suck their dick too? I, not on video. No, I don't got that. But I have done that. What do you think? We this guy is delusional. This guy is the epitome of being delusional. He's up to all the other shit. But like, I'm telling you what's in my heart. I don't feel like I ever really crossed or bashed my sexuality. I was a man that was exploring. And fun. in the content world, a lot of that's going on. Yeah, yeah. Let me tell you, there's a lot of homies a that lot of white boys, so we'll get that yes. out there right now. <laughs> you know, they, they know what's up. So, I mean, I got a lot of homies that hit me up. You, you think she's the only one that's got athletes hitting her up? Ever since the whole no jumper thing? I've had two pretty big black athletes, not not LeBron James and nothing like that, but I've had some pretty big athletes, uh, people that are in the Olympics, one guy in the Olympics. He sounds like a bitch. He sounds like a chick that that brags about who's sliding in her DMs. I got all these athletes and these rappers and these millionaires in my DMs. They're all trying to they're all trying to smash me. Bro, you're 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 proud of that? Like your mental illness is 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 that far to where you're like delusional about like I just, I can't understand this. It's not gonna say who messaged me. And we'll be fans. sitting there in bed and being like, what the fuck? Yeah. Yeah, you know I mean, <laughs> hey, I wanna see these videos. I'll sell them. Okay, $500 for the package. You wanna buy my bottom videos? That's gonna be $500. Because that's these, well, a lot of times at home, people are buying these videos because I was selling them cheap. My best friend Jordan Franco always said, bro, you need to be a porn star. I said, I know I do. I'm gonna be. I'm on my way to it. I'm gonna be something more than a. Now I'm on. Now I'm on a whole different route, though. There's, there, I'm way more more than just OnlyFans. I got. You'll forever be known as a guy that was dating a chick and <clears throat> dating a chick that is actually a man and still has her dingling. And the guy that thinks he's straight. Why letting other people smash him? In the behind, from behind. That's 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 all you're gonna be. Nobody's going to remember shit that you've done. You can do all the philanthropy in the world. None of that is going to fucking overcome your, your, <laughs> your weird fetish. I got a message that's going to leave a fucking impact on this world before I go. And please, stop that shit. Anyways, this shit was uncomfortable as fuck. Man. All right, see you guys in the next video.